All right, I think we're ready. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Yep. Let's switch over here. Hey, everybody, how's it going? Welcome to what hopefully will be the finale of uh, Armored Core 3, because, oh my god. Hmm. Uh, we ran into a literal wall last time, um, and that sucked. Uh, so hopefully today we won't have that problem and we'll be able to finish this game. Because um, I want to finish it for you guys. Alright, there's that. Quite loud in my ears. Let's load it up. <clears throat> Alright, gotta double check. It looks like everything's running properly. Hooray! All right, I think we're good. I think we're ready to go. Hopefully y'all are ready to go. Okay, so this fucking mission that we have to do here, um, I, I did a lot of research in between last stream and today's stream to figure out what the fuck's going on with it. So, um, from the Armored Core wiki, um, let's see, uh, defend energy reactor, which is where we're stuck, by the way. And see what we're working with here. All right, I want to bring this guy, but I want to bring actually no, I want to bring this guy, but I want to modify him for a specific setup here. All right. So according to the walkthrough from ArmoredCore.Wikia.com, equip either a well-armored AC to endure laser turrets or an agile one to bypass the shields quickly. When you start the mission, your path will be temporarily blocked by a hall of energy shields. While you can pass through them without stopping, you will sustain a fair amount of damage doing so. We've already established this. Energy turrets will open up from the ceiling to open fire. We've had to deal with those fucking things. Um, when you hear see the announcement, intruder detected activating security system, immediately advance toward forward and retreat into one of the gaps you're close to in order to avoid the upcoming energy blast fired from the end of the hall. Your goal is to make your way to the end and destroy the wall while sustaining as little damage as possible. Once taken down, you will be faced with a quad-like controller AC using the power laser weapon arms which do a considerable amount of damage. A well-armored AC with good energy defense can stave off the energy eccentric AC while a maneuverable one can dodge its attacks. However, you must be careful as not only are you on a time limit but that the energy reactor can sustain damage from your crossfire. So basically, shit we already know, right? Um, so my worry now is having to deal with this fucking thing. Uh, first of all, I'm worried about that fucking wall because we can get up to it taking fairly little to no damage. I've done that already. Um, my problem is once I get there, being able to destroy the thing quickly. Um, I am not about to fuck around with this thing anymore. So we're going to put that right arm piece on to deal with that fucking wall. So the idea is we are going to mod this freaking mech here to basically fire five or six rounds from this thing to destroy the wall. That puts us over by about 500 points, which means we need to get rid of some weight here, which means removing equipment. That one is staying because we'll be using that and the howitzer to destroy the AC um, that we have to fight. Um, and removing that, that'll be enough to switch us over to take care of this fucking, this mission. Whew. All right, you guys, I'm excited. I think, I think with this setup, we can do this. It's great as great because of that fucking damage on that right arm thing there. Um, the one time we actually made it through the hallway, um, we were able to then deal with the uh, AC, and we didn't have... We actually had a pretty easy time dealing with the AC, but um, uh, uh, my fire also destroyed the generator, which is why we lost that one time. Other than that, it's just been a shit show of getting into that room and getting past that first hallway. So I'm going to save really quick. <coughs> 
and just for this one, I'm not going to do it at any other point in time, I'm going to scum save states to deal with this. Because if we fail this mission, uh, we get a game over, which adds about 40 seconds to reloading everything. Uh, so we are going to... Nope. We're going to do our best to get up there and take out this fucking thing and then go for it. All right, defend energy reactor. I'll rewatch this since uh, it's been a stream or two since I played this. Raven, controller forces have succeeded in occupying the energy reactor. Their objective is it's just one guy. It's one guy and the fucking hallway from hell. Reaction causing extensive damage throughout the city. To make matters worse, ah, delicious. Security system has been activated. How's everyone in doing today? To Hopefully core, good. You'll have to bypass both gun emplacements and energy shields. It's such a fucking nightmare. We're running out of time. Good All right. luck. I'm hoping that taking some time away from this or off from this game will help us in in beating this. All right. So the first one we don't really have to worry about the machine guns. So what I want to do is I want to sit here and I want to wait and I'm going to overboost the fuck out of this hallway as soon as that shield comes down. And then try to get in. Shit. Okay. This is what we need to do. Next time it comes out, we're going to go across the other way. Did you see the outside temperature go up as that thing came around? forces have already reached the reactor's core. Shit, I fucked that one up. No, oh, get in there. Ooh. Looks like I should only be going one at a time, but I think we'll be all right. Get in there. All right. I think next time we'll be able to get two shots off. All right, something's shooting at me, but we should be all right. No! Shit! This is part of the reason I've been having problems with this, is just the controls are not that great. <sighs> okay. And here we go again. Of course something's wrong. There's somebody in there destroying the generator we're supposed to be defending. And I'm stuck out here shooting at a fucking wall. That might have done it. Maybe it didn't. Alright, come on. Let's go. Great! Okay, that was fucking worthless. That was fucking worthless. So here's the thing, how much damage does that fucking piece of shit eye wall thing take? I have no idea. Alright, we're gonna have to save scum this next one, because I fucked up here. Um, tremendously. I fucked up tremendously. Alright. This is like, this is the one thing in this entire game that's like this, and it's fucking horse shit, I tell you guys. Man, this is a nightmare. Thanks for bearing with me through all of this bullshit, you guys. All right, so we've already seen the thing. Raven, and it's like this and like four or five more missions after this and the game is done. So I've set aside a fair amount of time just to try and deal with this Main goddamn nonsense here. Here we go. Ah, crap. Man, I'm just getting too greedy with that. The problem, the problem is that if you, if if you're not careful, the damn uh, already reached the reactor's core. Uh, if you take too long. There's no time to waste. Anyways, if you take too long, um, uh, the mission fails. Anyways. So you're timed in this hallway. And I fucked up. Great. 
This is so fucking annoying, you guys. Seriously, I'm like right back where I was the other fucking day. This is bad. This is incredibly poor. <sighs> this fucking mission. And it's the only goddamn mission that's like this. It's the only one that's like this, too. There's no other literally smash your head against a fucking wall mission like this in the entire game. Got another shot off on it. And we're gonna move up one as soon as this one comes down. Get in there. Okay. Great. Well, that was a fucking waste. You gotta come around this corner fucking shooting like crazy. Gotta destroy that thing. This is the best we've done so far. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to save state scum. So we want to save state. There we go. All right, hopefully we can get through it this time because I'm not fucking around anymore. This is it. where we make our stand. This thing takes a ton of hits. Look at how many fucking grenades I've gone through on this thing. And now howitzers, now that I'm close enough. Shit. Come on. <laughs> I've got one left, and then I have to either use the howitzer or switch over to my chain gun, which I don't want to do. fucking up. I'm fucking up. See, and it has to be destroyed, too. You can't just... Great, and I took a fucking hit. Now I'm not going to be able to do it, so let's uh, load the state. Sorry, guys. This is what we have to do to deal with this. Incredibly poor. Oh, did I already take a shot? Yeah, it did. I missed it somehow. Interesting. Alright. You guys got any tips for destroying this thing? It looks like I can just kind of walk across twice to take care of it, but it still takes so much damage. And I don't know... Look at this, you guys. This is fucking crazy. This is absolutely insane. Damn. So I'm already eating into the chain gun here. So equipping the grenade was a good idea, but it's so far it proved to be completely fruitless. There we go. Okay, okay, here we go. This is what we need. I'm saving right the fuck here. I'm fucking saving this state. Now we never have to do that hallway again. System. Save state. We've done it. We did it, you guys. Fuck yeah. And I'm destroyed already? Way to fuck it! What is... What happened? Shit. <laughs> How much health do I not have? Wow. Come on. It did so much damage, right? And it's shooting the fucking thing. Shit. I'm causing damage to this fucking reactor, too. Yes! Yes! Fuck yeah! Fuck you, fire 
Ugh. Okay, good. D good. Thank thank God you guys got <laughs> so fucking done. I was done. That mission was horse shit. It killed the vibe of the last fucking stream. Luckily, now we don't have to deal with it ever again. You know, before we save, we're going to go back to the garage and we're going to reset our items here. So back to our thousand round machine gun. Throw the energy cannon on the back there and switch you back out for the better stuff there. Now we've still got 60 weight to fuck around with. Problem is, I'm like... Like, except for switching out that and getting more of a charge drain, I'm more or less have... I've more or less fully optimized this... this... friggin... armored core here. Oh, wow, I can use this thing? No way. No, I can! Look at that! That increases my armor points, but drops my defensive points by a ton. And increases my moving ability. It's not the fastest one by a long shot, but... Hmm... 31 and 1,000, 32 and 944. You know what? Why not? Let's try something a little different here. Wait, that's right, I need to set up the back stuff with this. So, nope, never mind. I want access to my back stuff. I want access to my back bits. All right, we're set back up the way we need to be set up. Let's save, and let's beat this fucking game, you guys. <laughs> oh, I am, so, I am so happy. I am so happy that we finally did it. Save complete. All right, I saved, and it's time to go on. My waifu just came home. Oh, we have some more. We have some more missions here. Destroy massive MT. I feel like we did this already, but whatever. What do we got? Our long-range scanners have acquired a massive target moving through sector 720. Uh-oh. Given its current heading, we believe that a nearby energy reactor is in imminent danger. Oh, shit. Unleashing something of this magnitude can only be the work of the controller. Whatever its intentions, situation looks grim. So get out there and fucking kill it. Regardless, we can't just give in. Destroy the target at all costs. Will do. Oh, hey, I can hire a couple guys here. Maybe. I can hire Kaiser for 20,000. But I feel like... Shit, Apple Boy's still basic. Skilly is probably going to be the best bet for damage with all those machine guns they've got equipped. Uh, you've got another machine gun. Yeah, we'll bring along this guy here. Let's see what we can do. So I wonder if I still had MT consorts to deal with if perhaps those guys would ended up would have ended up... Uh, um, like being able to hire a couple of them at once. That looks kind of cool. I bet this thing's gonna fuck me up a couple times. I bet this is gonna become the new wall. Okay, fine. I'll be careful. Where is it? Should be a giant thing floating in the fucking sky somewhere. Oh, yep, there it is. Oh, fuck you! That's stupid, and you're stupid. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Here we go. Okay, this is actually pretty fucking cool. Shit, fuck you. This is a fight right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Those things are no fun. Can't. Can't bunny hop with that one. Bunny hop with this one, though. Unload everything I've got into this, into this fucking thing. Wow, look at the damage it's done to me. Those lasers, I think, were what what uh, got me the worst. Target destruction confirmed. 
Yes! Raven, return to base. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, okay. So that was literally the wall. They should have called that mission the difficulty wall because fuck, that was it. That was it. We're just we're just blowing through them now. Mm, money. Ah, delicious. I made exactly sixty five thousand. That's awesome. How that ended up working out. Cool. We did it. I didn't have to worry about destroying the big one at all. I guess. Or the, the other one. <clears throat> Alright. Here we go. Crashing towards the end here. A new part from Union. <clears throat> new part has been added to the shop, manufactured by Mirage, and only supplied to a select few. It's a core part. <gasps> yes! The fucking best core in the game! Yes. This is the way. Infrastructure maintains that Layered is failing. History tells us that Layered has always been under the guidance of the controller. It's the only way Layered can exist. <clears throat> Perhaps you are strong enough to take on the controller, but I don't know what would be left of this world if you did and succeeded. I can't say this, though. We needed the controller. Raven, do you really believe you're making the right choice? Who fucking... Who fucking cares? Ugh, that was painful. Alright, let's see. Do I have to buy this core? I do. Look at that thing. Mirage's standard high AP model. So the AP is really high, and I believe the weight is less than uh, the other middleweight core. So we might be able to do some more. I do have Sky Eye equipped on this one. Yeah, it's better by about 100. Actually, there's less AP on this, but the defensive points are higher. The maximum weight is lower, but that's no big deal. And it's an EO core, which is going to be useful for us. All right, so that gives us about 150 extra weight to work with. I want to see if I can't equip a better, a non-energy back unit, since we're not worried about money at this point. Hey, you. You washing that thing? Cool. All right, I want to see if I can't equip a non-energy cannon. Like, obviously, that would be ideal, but I don't have to wait for that. This one would be good, too, but that, we can't use that weight. The damage is good, though, for the weight. Hmm, maybe a rocket? Here. Let's buy that. Uh, that might work. See, the thing is, let's take a look at the weight of the energy cannon. The energy cannon weighs 382, so I've got, what, about almost... I can equip something around 500. So, like, this thing is... it weighs too much. One of these missiles actually wouldn't end up being too bad. Mid-sized missile, max lock 2. That might also be useful. Yeah, there's no, like low-weight shoulder-mounted cannon. I guess I could equip a second machine gun on the shoulders, but I want to be able to bunny hop while firing a machine gun, so I guess that's out of the question here. Um, if anything, I could go back to my better head. No, I fucking can't. <laughs> Sky Eye's pretty damn good, though. Alright, overweight, 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 overweight. Not overweight. I could equip a second machine gun. Oh, so I can equip something around 600. Really? Wait, since when is my weight so low? Five thousand forty-two. Oh, because it would switch the thing out. I get it. And has this is five thousand fifty with three hundred and ninety. Hmm. Okay. I would almost be interested in equipping like a better arm. Or something like that, but there isn't really anything that fits the bill for what I want. Hmm. 1,062 for that. 683. Equipping that would almost be beneficial, but I do not want... Not the Karasawa. That weight is so prohibitive for that thing. 10, 462. 
No, I think this is what we're going to go with, and we're going to use those rockets for big targets, because you know there's going to be some big fucking things to shoot at at some point here. And let's equip some optional parts. We've got a lot of, a lot of space here. Improves turning speed. Enlarges the sight lock. I might not need that. Nah. Disables lock-ons. Increased generator capacity. And reduces damage. So I've got two more to fuck around with. Can I buy a better, another optional part that requires two slots? Improves braking and improves, reduces impact shock. That could be useful. See, those were all three. Got some missile display and improves fire rate. See, I don't need that. I don't need that. Fuck it. We'll buy these and put them in. Better than nothing, right? Reduces impact shock. And where's the braking? There's the braking. Okay. So we've got all that stuff equipped. Shop, paint, cockpit, inventory, AC test. Apparently it only ha it has merely good performance. Oh well, fuck it. I'm fine with being just good. Seven out of ten. Seven out of ten, you guys. I'm a seven out of ten. That's a big fat red onion. Thanks, Sam. You know, I didn't look at the amount of potatoes required for that recipe, so I might be making a half thing anyway, so there might be extra of that. Who knows? Alright, so we have saved. Let's continue on with these missions here. Layered hub. Is this the last mission? This might be the last mission. I might have fucked up. Yo, King Thunder, how's it going? We finally got past the wall. I had to save state scum the fuck out of it. Um, after this, we're doing Silent Line. Not today, because I've got shit to do. So, not today, sorry, but it's gonna happen. All right, infiltrate layered hub, $150,000. I've hit the final level. Dude, that difficulty wall is literally just that one fucking wall, that one fucking hallway. Fuck that shit. Is there stuff like that in Silent Line? I'm gonna be grumpy if there is. Let's see what Union has to say to us. Analysis of the data acquired from Mirage is complete. It revealed the location of the controller's core. We're sending you in. It was easy, dude. I had no problems with it. Have we made the right decision? We don't know. We can't say why the controller malfunctioned in the first place. Yeah, we had no problems with the massive MT. All we can do now is hope. Good luck to you. Like, I got hit with a few lasers that almost killed me, but um, once I started bunny hopping with my hand machine gun, it became a non-issue. All right, here we go. Final mission. I'm assuming I'm going to have to fight some ACs here, so... Operation Code Zero Division. Down. Let's take a look at this level. I don't know if I've ever gotten here before. That looks kind of badass. So people just have had no idea where to do this. No, I used machine guns, dude. Uh, machine gun shoulder and my uh, hand machine gun. Without a consort to get the moonlight blade. Whoops. I did it with a consort. What is this? What is this? What the fuck is firing at me? Oh, the walls are firing at me. How nice. There's nothing I can do about it here. Come on, come on. I hope I actually have to climb up this way. Damn, these things are uh, causing me problems. I don't think I have much in the way of... There's a door. I don't think I have much in the way of uh, energy defense. There we go. That was a fucked up hallway. That massive fight was actually super, super easy. Um, we had no problems with it. Those things are fucking trouble. Okay, where do we go next? I see a door to the left there. We're about to do it, guys. We're about to beat this damn game. 
Um, I might actually try that. As long as we can get through these fucking laser hallways. Probably would have been smarter of me to keep an overboost core on for stuff like this. But, um, I like what I got. Alright, here we go. Loading screen. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Thanks for always hanging out for these uh, armored core streams, King Thunder. Look at the look at everything fucking up. Wow. All right, down or up? I don't know how I feel about whatever's going on. Oh, we're going down. It's from Crest. I did buy that middle way to core. We're not sure what it is you hope to accomplish. Possibly be gained by upsetting the current order. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Come on. Those things are dead. More of them though? Yep. Come on, open up. Open up. Yeah, fuck yourself. Is that a door? Behind this door. A place I haven't been. Oh, I missed a couple doors, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Alright, what's this? Is there anything here? Nope, nothing. That was just where the uh where the uh the floating droid things came from. We're going down here, let's keep going. Don't spoil me on what's gonna happen in the middle of here. I wanna be surprised. Shit! Bitches. Yeah. Got both of them. Ha 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 ha. Am I at the bottom yet? Yes, I am. Okay. Fuck away from these lasers. I should have worked on the the. I should have worked on the uh, the laser defense for sure. All right, what do we got? Another loading screen. Oh, look at this guy. What fucking weapon is that? Oh, that's the same guy I killed before. Fuck this guy. You gonna die, boy. Where's he at? Oh, he's up here. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, boy. Not too many problems. I want to make sure I take out. I don't want to split my. Uh... Shit, shit, shit. These guys could be problems. Alright, that one's down. Bunny hops for the fucking win, you guys. Yes! this fucking machine gun nonsense. Is that it? You guys were literally nothing. Eh. They did a fair amount of damage to me. That went alright. What do we got here? It's a big fucking thing. Another fight? Another fight? We got another fight? Come on, fight. Give me another fight. What is this room? I'm gonna have to climb that, aren't I? I'm gonna have to climb that while some shit fucking fires at me. Oh, these things are these things are troublesome. Come on, can we get up here? I have a target thing somewhere. Okay, how do I get to that? Do I have to go up to the top? Do I have to go around? Can I just go through this? No, I cannot. There's gotta be some stuff I have to destroy. Any ideas, Thunder? Okay, yeah, there's stuff to destroy here. Uh-oh. Wasting all my ammo. <laughs> Alright, 
I've destroyed those things. Is it these wall things I gotta destroy? Everything's a mystery, you guys. It's not that. What is that? Uh oh. Oh crap, I'm out of ammo. Go to the part specifically marked target. That's what you need to hit. Okay. Do I have to just. Like that? These things coming out and fucking with me are causing serious problems. Good news is they're relatively easy to hit. So yeah, I get that I need to go to that part. Is it the actual pillar that I'm supposed to be shooting at, or is there a way in there? Is it that red strip? And I'm getting my poo pushed in by these stupid little drones. All right, how's this? Is this it? Yes. Energy reactor. Destroy it and you should neutralize the controller. Oh, I see. I'm glad I brought all this damn ammo. proven to be impre incredibly useful since I can just sit there and shoot at the fucking thing. Uh-oh. We did it. I think we did it. Good. We've destroyed the giant AI penis at the base of the Earth. Final directive? Is this Armored Core's final solution? Uh-oh. Oh man, the whole screen, everything's going crazy. What was that? Something about the surface? Something about the surface? Oh shit. Was that the finale? That was the finale. So it's literally kill two guys in a hallway and then blow up a, a ground penis. Look at that, the surface. We did it. We can finally go out from underground. Ours is the drill that will pierce the heavens. <laughs> Damn. We did it, you guys. We did it. We've opened our way up to the surface. I'm so happy that I finally beat that fucking hallway. Oh, shit. Armored Core 3 staff. All right. So that was Armored Core 3. We've got a few more cleanup things to do after that we'll still do on, on stream. But uh, that was pretty good. I don't think it ended with the same... Excuse me. With the same cool-ass ending that the first... Uh, that the, the first one we played, Armored Core 2, did. Uh, but this was still a lot of fun, and I think this was still a really cool game. Except for that one fucking hallway. Fuck that fucking goddamn fucking hallway. I want you all to know how grumpy I am about that hallway. 
So yeah, thanks FromSoft for a cool game. Let's skip that. And let's save our game. Fuck it. Let's save over Arby's. Smug Wendy is now the canon pilot for this timeline. Bam! All that money. Alright, so next step, it's going to take me to the loading screen. Yep, and then we're going to load that up. We're going to do a couple missions, finish a couple more... Uh, uh, a couple more arena fights, and that'll be it for Armored Core 3 and for our time with it. Fuck yeah. Push start button. Load game. Load memory card slot one. Alright, there's the file we want. Badass. We did it! I'm so happy. I have new mail. I believe this is where we get the extra part. First of all, Union, new part. Part has been added to the shop. It's manufactured by Mirage and supplied only to a select few. It is the super cool back part. Awesome. Here's our thing. There's a raven in the arena named Exile. We'd like you to defeat him. You don't need to know the reasons why, but your services are required. You are a very capable pilot, but Exile is much more powerful than anyone you've encountered up to this point. If he proves to be too much to handle, you may want to consider equipping the optional part that was recently added to the shop. The parts model is OP Intensifier! You might be interested to know that it has special hidden functions. Be aware though, should you decide to use this part, you may not be considered an honorable raven. Oh, so like all the fuckers in the top 10 of the goddamn arena? All right, so we've unlocked OP Intensify, and we've got extra arena. Look at this. Look at actually, okay, it looks like we've got a lot more to do here. This is fucking awesome. Look at this. Smug Wendy. I can't read anything about Smug Wendy. All right, I click on this. What happens? All right. So this is this is actually one on two fights. This is really cool. Uh, we're not going to do that yet. First of all, we're going to go buy OP Intensify. Shop, optional parts. OP Intensify. Zero stuff. Okay. And they unlocked the back string unit. Look at that fucking energy cannon thing. Four barrel energy cannon. Each shot does 720 ra or damage, and it has 20 shots per click. Or, you know what I mean. Also, if you could name your dick after a fighting game move, what would it be? Mine is Astral Finish. Uh, Rising Tackle. Fuck it. I don't know. I'm just being an idiot. Alright, inside extension radiator. Okay. Let's switch over to our, uh... <laughs> beast destroyer piece here. We've got to get rid of all this. You know what? We need to do some, uh... Some stuff with this. First, first of all, we need to switch to that. We've still got the heavier part on there. Okay. The weight is still good. Now let's equip OP Intensify. Tell me about what OP Intensify does with the base setup, sir. Uh, let's see. There's another thing I wanted to grab here. Ammo storage by 20%. That was it. <laughs> Just only ever use <laughs> the ammo on the machine gun here. So it's 20% and 20%, so that's 100 and 100. So that's an extra 200 shots for that thing and the flamethrower. OP Intensify doesn't actually have, of its bon have any of its bonuses yet. You have to do specific tasks to get them, one of which is to destroy the massive MT mission in which you need to destroy both parts of the MT to get 
Fire back weapons while moving bonus. I like that. Okay. So who knows? Maybe we'll have a whole nother stream where we just load up that OP intensify shit before we go over to Silent Line. All right. <laughs> so we've got our crazy ass dual wielding set up. There's no other left hand parts I've unlocked, is there? Don't think so. Nope. All right, let's go do some arena shit. Because there's more stuff to do in the arena itself. Look at all these guys. They threw a ton of guys in here. Here's the ones we had before. Brass, Bilbo, Ducks, Endymion, Apple Boy, Regina. Oh, Exile is... <laughs> he's super fast, and he's got the stealth set up with the machine gun. This guy is fucking trouble from the looks of him. AC's name is Painkiller. All right, let's work our way down the list instead of up the list this time. Fuck it. All right, Brass, an exceptional pilot. He's well-versed in ground combat tactic tactics, and it shows. He puts his AC's mobility to good use, always presenting a difficult target, and is more than happy to trade fire with his opponents while on the move. All these guys have, like, machine guns and shit at this point. And this guy's got basically the same setup as me. Let's try the arena. If the arena doesn't work, we'll cheese him out in the damn thing again. <laughs> this might turn into the uh, the parking lot stream. Apparently I'm overweight. Why am I overweight suddenly? I'm having some serious fucking problems with this. Actually, no, I'm not. He's going down. Why am I overweight? Did equipping the shoulder things make me overweight? Maybe it did. Come on. I've got more ammo than I know what to do with, so this is actually not a problem. Come on. That was easy. Yeah, I'd highly recommend checking a fac and doing all the OP intensify stuff before moving on to Silent Line. Okay. Not viewing the replay here, but we need to check that overweight shit because I don't remember putting myself overweight. And maybe I just totally wasn't paying attention there. 1,500 credits. Great. Garage. Assembly. I am overweight. By quite a bit. There we go. I can't believe I put myself at overweight without even, like, noticing it. All right. So we're basically working our way through the easy guys to go to the hard guys, and then we'll be doing the two-person fights later. Anyone with green thumb as well as a real love for nature. Bilbo Swaggins. Bilbo Dildo Dildo Baggins. Dildo Swaggins. Bilbo Baggins. Uh, she donates most of her winnings to the Underground Botany Project in support of her favorite cause. Uh, her AC design equips energy weapons to the exclusion of all others. Okay, I'm going to light you on fire. <laughs> I'll light you on fire. you going to die tonight, boy. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, I was seriously overweight last time. Look at the difference in the movement speed now. So here's Captain Energy use over here. Oops. Yeah, you go, yeah. Okay, what, what? It's done, it's over? Jesus Christ. Remember when I was having trouble with this game? <laughs> Shit. This is good, this is real good. The extra arena is actually a two-on-two -two mode where you choose another pilot to fight alongside you. Okay, that's cooler than what I expected it to be. I like that. Can I choose the bitch that double-crossed me in the last stream that I murdered the hell out of? All right, Paranoia. A former street actor, he's taken to the show on the road and now performs only for his arena fans. Winning isn't important to him. It's the spectacle of it. He views Paradox, who has a similar background, as a rival. AC's name is Ice Walls. Got some ice walls for ya. And by that I don't I don't mean anything, I don't know. Yeah, that's super cool. I'm excited to check that out actually. 
God, I'm inside of the most proof. Can you even figure out how to turn around in order to fight me here? Good job. Good job. You did it. Yeah. You were the best. I think next time I'll equip the EO on there, uh, the Exceed Orbit, while doing that, while bunny hopping around. <laughs> to make for the stupidest, most unfair fight you've ever seen. That'll be fun. That'll be funny. All right, 6,000 credits for that one. So the credits are jumping up here. And Paradox. All right, Paradox. Oh, it's the same thing we were just fighting, basically. A former street magician, he's taken the show on the road and now performs only for his arena fans. Winning isn't important to him, it's the spectacle of it. Literally, word for word, the other fucking guy. He views Paranoia, who has a similar background, as a rival. Let's do it. Let's go to the fuckery. <laughs> I'm a child. I don't understand why they... Just with the bunny... Oh, it's dead already! Wow, that was stupid and fast, and that was the best. This is the way. <laughs> oh, I'm having fun with the game and the stream again, you guys. Let's do this forever, shall we? There's 7,000 credits for that asshole. Yeah, it's cool. It's like we work our way down this time instead of up. Remember when we fought all those assholes back when we had the basic frickin' uh, setup? Alright, pass ahead. He loves new toys, as any who have seen his AC can tell. To him, performance and compatibility are secondary issues, and this stance has been his downfall more than once. Other ravens watch him closely to find out which new parts hold promise. Okay, that's kind of cool. Now, by the power of blackface koopy sandwiches, you will dirt Shit. <laughs> no matter how much you ask, I will never wear blackface. No. No, I'm kidding. I hate to be thirsty for viewers, by the way, and I've never asked this before, but, uh, King Thunder, you know anybody else who'd be interested in these streams? Because if you do, I'm trying to kind of grow the audience and get more people interested in the stuff we're doing. Wow, he's already almost dead. So between my, my energy EO boosters and that, it's crazy. That, look at the arm freaking out, the left arm. Do y'all see that? Cause like his dancing. He's dancing. Eight thousand credits acquired. Let's keep going. We're gonna get through this in no fucking time. And then we're gonna do the extra arena that I really like the fact that the extra arena thing is in here. Alright, ducks. This pilot changes occupations like some people change their socks. Uh He's always on the lookout for more money and accepts missions based only on their reward. He refuses to use shell weapons, which, as we all know, costs money. Yeah, it costs some fucking money. Ooh, he's got, actually, a really good setup with the extra, the, the emergency energy and all those energy weapons. This guy might not be tough. Let's go to the rest over. Fuck it. Yeah, Luna was having fun in here for a while. That was a good, that was a good time. And I have not seen Luna in actually like half a week, I think. Come on. Shit. All right. Time to actually turn it on. He got me with the thing a couple times. God, they can't do anything. They're getting hit with energy weapons, a fucking shell weapon that hits pretty damn hard, and they're getting hit with flame. This is like the ultimate arena offense, you guys. This is fucking crazy. That I'm able to just sit here and just go like... 9,000 credits acquired. Alright. We've got a few more before we don't have to go up all these pages. They unlocked a ton of guys, actually. Alright, and Dimion. Uh, he's the descendant of a noble knight, but all proof that could corroborate his claim has long since been lost. His mother labors tirelessly to restore the family name, and Endymion became a raven to help bankroll their efforts. 
All right, so you got a shitty little missile and a sniper rifle and some sort of crazy extension I don't realize. Okay. Let's take this outside or inside. I don't know. Isn't everything in this game technically inside? Because that's the whole thing is that you're like underground the entire game. And that's the one where you start behind each other. Between the EO and occasionally actually hitting this guy with my bullets, this is, like, ridiculous. <laughs> this is ridiculous how easy these guys are getting destroyed. It's either a streamer or a YouTuber that I don't think would appreciate me advertising your stream. Aw. Okay. That's okay. I wasn't, like I said, I'm not trying to be viewer thirsty or anything. I just like the whole community aspect of having everybody hanging out, talking about the game, talking shop. All right, Apple Boy was our friend uh, from the very first mission. New to the arena fold, his AC sports a very rudimentary setup. He prefers head-to-head -head battle with as little fooling around as possible. He's an honest man, but his abilities remain in doubt. Becoming a raven has been a lifelong ambition. All right, time to put you in your place, bro. Bro. Gonna get you. X gonna give it to you. The range on these things, especially since I don't actually have to fire them, uh, makes this crazy. Come on. Like, I don't even have to bunny hop anymore. I can just slowly walk in a circle around these guys and occasionally shoot them with my... Look at my arm freaking out. It's like... Argh. It's like air jacking off to taunt the other AC pilot. It's not weird. Shut up. <laughs> All right. Did I get 11,000 for that? Wow, that was, uh, it was either 11,000 or 1,100. I don't know. All right. Regina, an aggressive combatant who pilots an AC with a variety of high power weaponry. She likes to put on showy battles, but her AC's limited ammunition stores mean that they have to be concluded quickly. Her father is also a raven. Echidna, we have not gone to parking yet, have we? Let's do it. <laughs> okay. You just do whatever it is you need to do. There you go. Already almost completely dead. Oh, you got a shot in. Good job. <laughs> These are ending in less than 20 seconds. This is crazy. I feel like this is overpowered as fuck. I was reading something. I was reading the Metacritic review, uh, some of the user reviews for Silent Line uh, to see kind of what I had in store. And somebody was talking about um, some, like, mid-range machine gun that is apparently fucking amazing. And so now I'm, like, thirsty to check out that machine gun. But we've still got plenty of game to work through here, surprisingly, so. Oh, this is cool. We're working through the uh, the the guys that, the empty pilots that became AC pilots throughout the story now. All right, Cold Heart. Formerly an empty pilot working for Crest. His journey to become a raven has been both long and arduous. He is still getting accustomed to piloting an AC, but his frontline experience and instincts are top notch. He is expected to do well. Uh, not against me, though. <laughs> Never against me. <laughs> like with the bunny hopping, not really using... With the bunny hopping, not using any... Um, shit. The bunny hopping, not really using any energy. Leaving the energy for the, the exceed orbits. And then having the flamethrower and the machine gun. Wow, you're actually doing a good job there, bud. Shit, 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 shit. Every now and then I screw up where I'm aiming. The Pixie 3. Well, the name doesn't sound very intimidating. I'm wasting so much ammo on this asshole. Ah, that was it. I think I lasted a little longer than the others. The 
Pixie 3. It's a fantastic machine gun and one of my favorite weapons. Okay, so basically I have something to buy immediately once I get into that game. Cool. Good to know. I am prepared. 20,000 credits acquired. And on to Huntress. This is the bitch that betrayed me. I'm gonna fucking destroy her, you guys. She hasn't been a raven long, but her mission success rate is impeccable, and she's in high demand because of this. The grateful recipient of many corporate-sponsored gifts, she takes to new equipment with a fervor. Well, I'm gonna take my new equipment and rip her in half. Yeah, I read that it has 800 rounds. That's great. I'm gonna introduce you to the tropical forest, girl. And by introduce, I mean I'm gonna fucking light you on fire while shooting you while melting you with energy weapons. You bitch. It's already firing at her. Like, I love how this thing is firing at her before I even have access to a lock. Remember that time you betrayed me? In that mission there? Oh, she got behind me. Good job. I wasn't very happy about that. Now you're dead. It's not available right away, though. Damn! So what you're telling me is I have something to look forward to mid to late game. Cool. That's fine. That's fine! I know, I'm a dumbass. 2,100 credits. And... Damn, we still have a lot of ways to go through all this stuff. First glance, he appears to be just another trick. Oh, this guy! Yeah, I like this guy. I'm not going to go easy on him, though. He appears to be just another trigger-happy machine gun newbie, but his decision to go with shell-based weapons was deliberate in order to offset the energy consumption of his AC's leg selection. So he's basically me. <laughs> he's calm under pressure and assertive. Yeah, I like this guy. This guy was a good consort to hire. I will fire you, or I will fight you in upstanding battle in the arena. Probably a tremendous waste right in the beginning there. Oh. See how, oh. Wow, that was uh, that was very quick. I think it shows up after six or so missions, maybe more. Damn, so I gotta do missions to do it. Okay, good to know. I'm not gonna view the replay. Twenty-two thousand credits acquired. All right, I'm gonna do one more, and then I'm gonna take a quick break to take care of a few things. No more than a minute, I don't think. Hey, this guy too. Yeah, I'm working through all my buddies here. The pursuit missiles mounted on his AC's shoulders are more for show than anything else, and his opponent's time is better spent worrying about what he intends to do with the machine gun. His AC is heavily armored and therefore slow. Before I'm twenty missions in, that sounds. That's fine. What haven't we done? We haven't done Wasteland here. Since I'm not skeezing it out on top of a building like in 2, I'm, I'm enjoying um, changing it up here. You know, people consider this game to be incredibly hard, like all of it. Like, the majority of the, the, majority of the things I've been reading about it say it's like, it's so hard. slow to outrun my bullets, but you're also heavy enough to just straight up ignore them. Wow, it ran out. Uh-oh. 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 It's becoming a problem. Oh, this is bad. Good thing this flamethrower is here to... Do. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Some sustained fire totally fucked it up. Fucked it up. Wow. That's good. No viewing replay here. All right, I will be back very shortly, you guys. Please bear with me. Like I said, less than a minute. Thanks.
Woohoo! I'm back. Hopefully you all didn't abandon me. I was waking up my daughter from a nice little nap she was taking. And now she's going to be playing very quietly while I do this dumb crap. <sighs> Did I miss anything in the chat? Majority of this game is nowhere near as hard as other games like Silent Line, Nexus, and Last Rain. So what you're telling me is that it's going to get worse. Crap. What do you want? Not right now. Go scoot. Go do coloring or play upstairs in your room, honey. Thank you. Okay. Let's keep on keeping on here. <laughs> We've almost made it through the majority of these guys. Not the majority of these guys, but we've almost made it through a lot of them here. All right, as an ex-pilot, old habits are hard to break, and he still prefers taking to the air and filling the sky with swarms of missiles. But like all fighter jocks, he's brash, which usually gets him in trouble when cornered. As an ex-fighter pilot, not a not an old old fighter or whatever the fuck I said. Okay, so this guy was the uh, was the the aircraft consort. That's cool. It's crazy that he would go from an aircraft to a heavy-legged AC. Which usually gets him in trouble when cornered. Okay. So let's fight you somewhere where your vertical missiles will have zero effect. <laughs> let's go. All right. So here we are with another fight. I mean, we've just basically been doing the same thing, which is turn on the exceed orbit and then unload into these guys. Oop. Oh, he got him. He got him too fast. He, uh, he's hungry for pain. Come on. Come on, there we go. Him boosting around is a pain in my ass. Where are you at, bro? There we go. The good news is when we do get him in range, he's, he withers pretty easily. That works out. All right, another one down. No replay. D t t t d d d d d d twenty four thousand. Man, I'm gonna make a ton of money here, which is gonna be great because I'll be able to carry it over to Silent Line. I have a feeling Silent Line isn't gonna be as difficult as you're hyping it up, specifically because by the time I get there, I'll have the OP intensify stuff up, and I will have almost an entire garage full of parts that I'll be able to customize from once I get into it, you know? Alright, uh, Sandoval. A tank nut, he's truly saddened that more pilots don't take advantage of what he considers to be the best leg parts available. He became a raven in order to prove that a tread-based AC can hold its own as well as any other. For the most part, he's right. Tread-based ACs you can just equip ridiculous weapons on. Um... The fact that you lose out on mobility kind of sucks, but, I mean, what are you going to do? You're silly. Shit. There we go. The good news is he's not fast, and he's not particularly well armored despite his tank treads. So, uh, this won't last much longer. There he's dead. That was it. That was fast. We did it. <laughs> oh, man. It's crazy that people... I mean, maybe it's just because I've been playing him so long I have a knack for it, but it's crazy that people think that, like, some of this stuff is challenging. And I, I had problems with some of this stuff as a kid. I'm not going to lie. All right, Hozumi. The teamwork between he and his disciple, Sukuyo is the stuff of legend. There isn't a single raven who looks forward to going up against both, no matter who they're partnered with. Hozumi retired, but returned to the arena to guide Sukuyo. Because I don't know how to pronounce those. All right, what are we looking at? We're looking at a pile bunker and another howitzer? I think that's a howitzer. Or some kind of grenade launcher pistol thing. Um, shit. Okay, we can do this. Let's go to the structure. Let's keep, let's keep moving around here. Is the stream uh, holding up all right, you guys? From the looks of it, it, go I, I keep, I, it keeps showing that all my viewers keep disappearing, which is usually... 
Why is it just shooting at the wall there like that? Which is usually an issue that I see when um, the stream is, itself is having issues, like the stream quality. Hopefully it's all right. Sometimes it's just the way, um, the way, whatchamacallit. Where is this fucking wow? This guy is keeping the pressure on. He's actually not too bad. I have to stop bunny hopping for a little bit. He's too fast for me to actually hit. You see this? The good news is when he runs through. Shh, look at this guy. Fuck this guy. Wow. This is absolutely ridiculous, actually. Oh, but one thing and he's done. Sorry, I muted myself to yell at people. Bring it to me. Bring me the damn thing. Now. You're gonna cover this whole damn room in plastic, little girl. Kids. This is your life as a parent. Go get it. No throwing it around like I just did. Got it? She's like, I want to go swimming. But then, I'm not going to bitch. Not going to bitch. Having kids is a blessing. Okay, Suyu, Sukuyo. The amazing teamwork between Sukuyo and his mentor, Hozumi, is well known, and they remain undefeated in multi-AC combat. Uh, we'll put that to the test. Um... Uh, Tsukuyo joined the arena as Hozumi's, at Hozumi's request to keep his skills honed and up-to-date. So far, the practice is paying off. Are you going to throw that out? Thank you. Anyways, the majority of this game isn't nearly as difficult as some of the stuff in Silent Line Nexus or the entirety of Last Raven. Well, that's nice. That's good to know. Okay, so we've got another... heavy, slow AC. Actually, those ta that tank tread looks cool. Yeah, I know, the trash can's outside. Go throw it away in one of the trash cans upstairs. And then remember, hey! Thank you. All right, we'll go to the arena for this one again. Is the stream quality all right, Thunder? It's, it's, it, I'm receiving indications that it may be going in and out. And slightly concerned. Oh, wow. He's going airborne a little bit. His doing, like, his short bunny hopping is actually causing problems. Oh, look at that. Then we get a few a few good shots on him in it, and it takes care of the problems we are having. All his little boosting and overboosting around. He's actually incredibly agile for using uh, tank treads there. I'm actually really impressed. Uh-oh. Alright, we've got to finish this quick. There we go. We've got to finish this quick. Perfect. Thanks, Thunder. I appreciate I appreciate you letting me know. I do. I do. I do. I do. Ooh. Oh, no. The audio. Shit. That might be the issue I'm having. Um, hopefully it's not. Hopefully it's good for everybody who's uh, hanging out here. 30,000 credits acquired. Calc... Calchas. A rare breed, Kalchus attacks almost exclusively with blade weapons. Because of this, his victory rate isn't high, but his unit does boast one of the most impressive flight durations of any AC in the arena. He's a loner and keeps to himself. Interesting. Alright, let's fight this guy. So basically, this guy's gonna fly around and be a tr tremendous pain in the ass, so we're gonna take him to the parking lot. Can you guys hear my daughter in the background? <laughs> Please let me know if you can so I can tell her to... Oh, sh Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. Like, shit. He's just constantly above me. What is this? What is this witchcraft? Oh, but he's dead already. Damn. 
Every time I look up, it's like, oh wait, all of his all of his AC's gone. Or AP. All of his armor points are gone. We did it. Working up to that fight with Exile. 60,000. Alright, Asylum here. Here we go. His AC is a product of the school of thought that the best defense is a good offense. Yeah. Yeah, those those uh, those arm pieces are real. He likes to get in close and unleash a flurry of attacks on his opponents. Anyone familiar with his strategy usually hopes not to experience it a second time. All right, where have we been in a while? Let's go to the factory. Set it right there. All right, let's go. Let's get him. No, go. I will put you upstairs for the rest of your existence, little girl. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. So, except for the fact that he's already dead, because he was slow and apparently really susceptible to flame, that was rough. That was really, really rough. No replay there. It's not fast enough to get a replay. All right, eighty thousand credits. Yeah, I, it was it was a right it was the right idea to work our way down this list. All right, on to Vector. When effectively combined with his AC's other weapons, the large missiles mounted on his shoulders are capable of wreaking absolute havoc. Yeah, I bet. Uh, he definitely has a flashy side, but his AC design is all about taking down the competition. That heat pistol is probably a problem. Yeah, that with the missiles, that's uh, that's a bad time. That's a bad time. I probably should not have gone indoors for this one. Or not have gone to a, a high ceilinged area for this one. No, stop. He's just firing at the wall. Oh. These guys always get stuck on the dam. You were supposed to be a threat. So basically, he couldn't use his missiles, so he just got shredded to death by the damn... by the firearms. Or by the... what am I saying? All he had left was his pistol, because he couldn't use his missiles, and he was too slow to avoid my shots. There we go, I've said it. 100,000 credits. So I'm, I'm going to make probably a million fucking credits here just from doing this extra stuff. Okay, this guy is only set up to use the Karasawa. Wow. Okay. Terra, his accuracy is something to behold, and the AC pilots he is designed and the AC he pilots is designed to maximize his use of right-hand weapons. The tactics he employs are exceedingly simple in their nature, but are devastating when executed with such fine precision and skill. AC name spectrum. Interesting. You know what? You've got a you've got a a, a serious uh, a serious gimmick there. So you know what? I'll, I'll meet you. Hopefully you'll fight me at your best. This'll be fun. Don't have to worry about missiles. I can just equip my exceed orbit and go for it. Oh. Wow. 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 Where are you? Where are you? This guy is a problem. This guy is a serious problem, oh my god. Shit. He... Wow! Fuck this guy! Okay, that was a loss. That was a serious loss. You recommend using the cheese in the parking lot? I think we're gonna go to the parking lot, but we're not gonna do it with the rockets. I'm I'm no good with rockets. He it he they aren't weren't kidding about his accuracy. That was that was impressive. That was very impressive. I'm impressed by the AI that you guys have programmed. Congratulations. <laughs> Time for me to put it down. <laughs> Scratch my nose. Where 
Where are you at? Where are you at? Okay. Okay, we're doing all right, except for the fact that I can't control my thing worth a damn. He's down lower than I am. Where the fuck is he? Does he get behind me so damn fast? Jesus Christ! Fuck this guy! Let them come at you and pelt them to death. That might end up being, that might end up being the thing I have to do. All right, the other one's kind of set up. Maybe we'll we'll try Baconator here. Baconator has a little bit more mobility than this one. We'll see if that doesn't help push the odds in our favor. That plus the uh, the shoulder machine gun might actually end up being a good thing. That with the howitzer, uh, it's worth a shot, right? Oops, not exile. Exile's our finale. Well, exile is, exile is our arena finale, I should say. All right, here we go. Terra again. Take you to the parking lot, which sounds really like horrifying when you say it that way. I'm gonna take him to the parking lot. Do I have Exceed Orbit on? Yes, but I'm not going to use it. Oh, this is entire. This is already entirely different. Oops. Actually, it's not going too much better. Maybe the heavier machine gun will cause some more. Shit, I keep getting caught up. I ran out of energy because I'm an idiot. That's what happened. This guy is... Oh, I've almost got him! No, 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 no! Shit! Oh, really close there. All right, so first things first, switch to that heavy machine gun on the shoulder and keep keep at it with the howitzer. I think that's what we're gonna... what we're gonna have to do here. We got him close. We got him really close there. It's just my dumbass running out of energy ended up uh, ruining it for us. Ruining it for me. God damn this fucking asshole! I will kill you. I will fucking murder you at some point. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh man, that was, that was, that was a shit show. And the lights going out is a fucking pain in the ass. <laughs> if I have to switch over to your trick to beat this guy, I'm gonna be so grumpy. I want to do it exactly the way I've been doing it. God damn it. I'm whining. I'm being a whiner. We're doing remotely better. Except that I can't keep him in my fucking sights. God damn, god damn, god damn. Oh, he's close. One more volley. Yes! We finally got him! Yay! I just had to bash my head against the wall again. <laughs> Use your black face stained with red lip stip stick to Oh my god. <laughs> no! Why? Why are you doing this to my stream? <coughs> Excuse me. 500,000 credits acquired. Nice. Alright, let's switch back over to Frosty. And let's fight this last guy. And then go on to the extra arena. Exile! He's fought on many battlefields and destroyed countless ravens. Stories of him cracking open ACs in mere seconds are used to frighten new pilots. You mean that thing I do? Uh, no one knows his background, but most claim he is even better than Ace. He's got a lot of ammo because of that thing. Uh, but his AC and his defense aren't aren't very... Um, not very impressive, bro. Alright. 
So I want to go to lower ceiling place. Actually, we will try the parking lot again. Hopefully this will work. Oh, he's doing the same thing I'm doing. Shit, he's got stealth pieces. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is slightly terrifying. We're doing the same thing to each other. I don't know where he is. Oh, shit. Oh, he fucking destroyed me. Did you see that? That was unbelievable. Absolutely crazy. We try Kansoru. All right. So he's not even good. He just has stealth shoulders. Is there anything I can equip that counteracts stealth shoulders? Like, is there some special radar or something that might... Stealth sensor provided. Okay. So this might actually end up... Yeah, okay, the stealth sensor. There we go. Okay. As long as I can target it, I can kill it. Let's see, this will probably put me way overweight. Wait, no, I want to go this way. No, it doesn't. Fucking, that's perfect. Equip this. Can I equip a better head? Since I have a radar on my shoulder, can I equip a head with higher armor points? 975, 353. 1,234. That's the heaviest head I can equip. Wait, shit. I went right past it again. There you are. Well, that's the. It's got the best armor points. What about defensive points? Seven. Four hundred fifty-four. Oh, that's the basic one. With. That's not bad. I don't think I need that. We're gonna try this head out since I have a shoulder thing equipped now. Um. More AC optimization. All right. There's guy. There's this one. Yeah, the armor and defensive points are better. That's good. And I actually have a little extra space to mess around with additional stuff. Enhanced shielding. Hey, Thunder, does the enhanced shielding stuff... Um, does that provide extra shielding outside of using an actual left arm shield? Because if it does, I might be interested in that. All the good stuff equipped. 230, 300. Yeah, that charge stream is fine. Go for the heavier legs. Okay, we will try this then. I still got room for like 125 weight somewhere. What can I equip? Is there a better. 462, 519. <laughs> that would be nice. Nah. I wonder if switching to this one would be better. The high rate of fire is good. The fights actually end up do being a little bit longer, but... Hmm. Attack power, 235. Attack power, 1,250. The fact that that thing just, like, shreds people's health off is pretty crazy, but I like having the heat. I like the heat on there. Um, so let's go with that. It's great is only good, but that's fine. It's good enough for the arena. Quick save, and then from there we shall continue. Alright, save complete. Alright, time to try this guy out again. 
Your stealth sensor ain't shit, bitch. I'm gonna break you over my machine gun, boy. <laughs> Wait a minute, why can't I? Oh, because it just... Wow, that was rough. Okay, so the stealth sensor lets me see him on my radar, but that's it. Nope, shit, I pressed the wrong button. Okay, go. Oh, man, we came really close that time. Let's try structure, why not? Yeah, the fact that they disabled the lock, that's what I was hoping the radar would do, but the fact that I can at least see him on my radar makes it okay. Man, if there was like an extension, or an op, not an extension, if there was an optional part I could equip that would uh, fix that, that would be awesome. You're stuck over there? Yeah, you are. It's fine with me. Shit. And he's fucking... Mm! And I'm already out of fucking everything. Oh, this guy. Oh. I might have to do this a different time. You know what? We're gonna move on. We're gonna move on for a little bit. Um, we'll go do the two-on-two -two stuff for a while. Then maybe work on the OP intensify stuff on another stream, and that son of a bitch will be the finale of the stream. Don't gen bust nerd. You're right. Also, hello, fuck Buddington. Where is the boost hop? <laughs> I I'm I wasn't boost hopping with him at that particular time. I was using the parking lot. It was. You saw me do it. Okay. Okay. I, I'm going to take a quick break to do this, and then I will go back and try the parking lot. Let's see. Who can I hire? I can hire anybody. Royal Mist. Why not? Oh, I remember that guy. Yeah, screw it. It doesn't matter what you do anyways. Or what my partner does, as long as he soaks up some fire while I get my uh, <laughs> stupid bunny hop flamethrower machine gun build murder on. Oh, this is cool. Alright. You're pretty easy. Look at his health just melt. Alright, that one's down. Where's your friend? That was it? Oh, we only have to take out one of them? I can use Arena AI Glitch. Please inform me about the Arena AI Glitch, Mr. Fuck Buddington. Fuck Buck. King, fut Buckington. There we go. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> 2,500 credits. I'll wait for you to type that up and do another arena mission here. All right. Strasburg and wake up. If you kill the leader, you automatically win. Okay. So which one's the leader then? Is it the... Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure who the leader is. Let's bring along Regina. She was a good fight. If you don't move left or right at the start of a match in the arena, the AI won't move left or right. <laughs> They'll boost straight at you. No kidding. Okay. You can just shoot at them with a grenade launcher like four times. I actually really like that, and I have something just for that. Actually. Come here, you. You like fire? Shit, you got around me quick. You like barbecue there? I hope you like barbecue. Okay, you're dead. Right, where's your friend? Man, apparently the leader always starts to the right of me. View, replay, cancel. Alright, let's see if we can't cheese this guy out. 
We got through the entire Armored Core 2 stream cheating. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's cheat. Hope you guys are ready for cheat. So I've got shitty salad over here. On whom I can equip a large, heavy grenade launcher. Do I have the big grenade launcher shoulder purchased? I do. 8,000. Get rid of that thing. I can equip just grenade launchers on this guy. Oh, wait. No. That's right. It's a different uh, back part. Whoops. <laughs> All of these things put me a little overweight. That one's got me at one weight. That's perfect. Okay. Okay, we can do this. All right. This thing is apparently excellent because it has so much damage. <laughs> let's, let's go. Let's kill Exile by making him run straight at me. If this works, Foot Buckington, I'm going to be very happy and I'm going to thank you. Might even show you my titties. Where are you going? Okay, that worked. Where is he? Shit, I've screwed it up. I've screwed it up. I've fucked it all up. Because he came right at me. Whoops. I'm trying to do it with a blade. God damn. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry, you guys. Okay, here's the end. That fucking stealth. They still fly up and down, though. Crap. Okay, so I need to go inside, is what you're telling me. Got it. Got it. Okay. Okay. Let's try this cheese. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> I can't cheat properly, you guys. I can't do it. All right, so back to the parking lot. Uh, factory, reservoir, wasteland, parking lot. Only works in arena stage, not any other map. Damn! It might work. Crap. I can't handle this. You know what? Fuck this. Fuck you! <laughs> God damn it! Oh! I might have to try the large rockets trick. Oh man. This guy is a serious problem. You know what I can do? Rocket launcher and flamethrower in parking lot. Possibly. But we're going to try this. So it's only if I move side to side. So I'm going to back myself up into the wall so he can't get behind me. And then I can just keep aiming at him. Hopefully. Oh, I'm in a, I'm in a door. I'm in a door. He's got no choice. Come on. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! <laughs> damn it! <laughs> that might have worked. All right. I'm gonna try this guy one or two more times. I like being able to back myself into that hole. Hopefully, hopefully the hole will save my day. Um, wow. Yeah, no, I know. All right. <laughs> try this. You can't out DPS aerial moonlight hits. You're right. <laughs> but goddamn it, I'm gonna try. Assembly. All right, machine guns 462. I've got a little extra weight there. Not enough for anything good. So fuck it. I'm gonna try this. <laughs> I'm going to be so happy if this stupid strat works. <laughs> Oh, man. 
I'm really showing my ass on this stream, you guys. I'm sorry. I swear to God, I'm better than this. Actually, this, this stealth shit in general is just a fucking nightmare. I will hit you with a random stray bullet. I will get you! Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, fine, I'll go to the parking lot. <laughs> if I sit in any corner of the parking lot, he might jump on your head and get stuck there. Okay, okay. We're gonna go hide in the parking lot from this asshole. <laughs> this is rough, I'm having trouble here. Wait, did I just, oh no! Oh god, oh jeez, oh god. I screwed up. Fuck you! I hate you! I want you to die! You're an asshole and I hate you and I've run out of all my charge. Just kill me! You son of a bitch, I hate you! Man, those moonlight hits are trouble. Okay, now we're gonna go to the damn thing. I'm not gonna hit retry. I don't know why I was on retry in the first fucking place. Cancel! There we go. <laughs> Fuck this guy, you guys. This guy is an ass. Alright. Exile. We're gonna fight him. And we're gonna go to the parking lot. I'm gonna stand in the corner. In any corner of the parking lot, he might jump on your head and get stuck there. Okay. <laughs> this fucking guy. Yo. Where are you at? Oh, he's stuck. He's stuck. He can't do anything. You ain't shit. You ain't shit. You're gonna die. You no, I'm gonna die. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Okay, that actually worked out all right. I'm gonna switch over to my heavy. I'm gonna switch some. I'm gonna switch some weapons around, and I think we'll be able to do this. I think. I think we'll have a shot at this. Um. Okay. 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 We have a strat. <laughs> switch back over to shitty salad. Um. Right arm weapon is a howitzer. And a grenade launcher. Keep suggesting a rocket launcher. Let's see what we got in terms of rocket launchers. Right arm here. Uh, I can use the I can use the shoulder mounted uh, rocket launcher. What do we have in terms of shell bazooka? Enhanced shell bazooka. That might be worth it. There's a big rocket. Yes, I know. There's a super heavy shoulder rocket thing I can do. Back unit large rocket. Where are you at? Fires three small rockets, large rockets, 18 rounds. Yeah, that's the one. I see what you guys are telling me to do here. You know what? We'll buy two of them. Fuck it. I'm sure it'll get used at some point. It'll get used when we go for the uh, the OP intensify stuff. For sure. Right, where are you at? All right. <laughs> Oops. We want to go over to assembly here. I want to equip the howitzer there. I want to keep that there. Oh, maybe I don't want to equip that there. <laughs> Didn't I buy another one? There you are. Over by just a little bit. We'll switch this out for that. Okay, now we're full on rockets. This has to be the way we destroy him. Our offensive points are 10,000. Compared to our other guys, like 36. Okay. <laughs> You're going down, Exile. I'm going to rip you in half. With everything I have at my disposal, this is it. This is it. Shit, I fucked up. Okay, I'm in the corner. Oops. Damn! He got me good. He got me good. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Yes, that is an unnecessary amount of rockets. I agree with you. <laughs> 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 
We're doing this. We are we are gonna kill this guy. We're gonna ruin him. We're gonna we're gonna destroy him. We're gonna touch his butt emotionally and metaphorically. Alright. Let's just slowly back up here. We're not we're not moving in any direction. Shit, he's already he's already on our ass. Where are you? No! Yes! Yes! You're gonna die! I'm gonna murder you! Yes! Fuck you! Fuck your family! I hate you! I want you to die! You're a piece of trash! Yeah! Get good scrub! Get good scrub! Yeah! Ah! It's fine! <laughs> Fuck you, dude! <laughs> no! No! You can give me a hug later! I've told you before, you don't call on the stream camera until you're old enough to make that decision, and that's when you're 18. Get your butt, you little goofball. We did it! Yes, I'm viewing that fucking replay. We're just sitting in a replay for like an hour while I ask you all to follow my ass. <laughs> so if you guys are enjoying this stream, you should leave a follow. If you would like to see the archives, we archive all of our streams on the YouTube channel, which you can find in the link below. We have mastered cheating! Now we just need to cheat through OP Intensify. That was fucking stupid. Look at this! Look at this! What are we doing? I don't know what to do with my hands. Look at, look at this asshole. Fuck him! Fuck you! Yeah! Yeah! Brick Squad! That's stupid. That was funny. Oh man. You know what? Once more for good measure. I want to see what he was saying. All right. Let's see. I want to see it specifically from his point of view. What do you got? What do you got? You ain't got nothing. Look at his turn speed, though. That, that Those leg parts are crazy. Like, the fact that he's just got a machine gun and the moonlight and the stealth stuff, that is a really good build, honestly. Look at that. He's like, oh, I don't know what to do about this. I don't know how to how to not be cheesed out by this shit. I don't understand. Oh, I'm dead. Oh no. Ow. Why would this happen to me? Ah. We did it, you guys. Thank you for all the cheating <laughs> bullshit awesome strats that you gave me. I appreciate you all as human beings. I appreciate your company. I appreciate I appreciate your sage wisdom. You are all clear. I got, I got, is that 150,000 or 1 million? That is 1 million 500,000 credits. Holy shit. Let's see. Did I get mail? No, they didn't give me mail. They're just happy I killed his ass. Yeah, they're just happy I killed his ass. Are you locked out? Oh, well, hang on. Hang on a second. I got to let my wife inside the house. Ten sec. Oh. Never mind. I don't have to let my wife inside the house. I don't know what her hands are covered in, but... <laughs> that was hilarious. That was crazy. Okay. All right. Let's screw around with some OP Intensify stuff. I think you said it was... Um, what, the massive thing? Which was up here. Do it without a consort and use those big, fat fucking things. This one. Defend water processes. Oh, wow. I actually missed out on... Several missions here. All right, let's go. Our long range so this is the one where you destroy. So I have to destroy uh, both pieces, right? I have to destroy the the lower part and the top part. So I'm assuming I have to shoot the top fart. Uh, top fart. Wow, fuck me. The top part first, right? I think so. We will see. All right, no consort. There's this big shitty chandelier that we have to blow up. We're gonna do it. I are winner. Yeah, America. All right, we've got this big heavy one. All right, let's see if I can do this. Oop. I'm bad at aiming these rockets, you guys. Do they have a? Do they have a range? Oh wow, that was that was really fast. L 
LS of ACO. Hi. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming to stream. I hope you enjoy large stream, hard streaming. Where did that fucking thing fly off to? Oh, there it is. Wow. Uh-oh. I hear I hear hell coming after me from the back. I'm going to go hide. I'm going to go hide from that fucking thing. Uh-oh. 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 I've screwed up. I've screwed up. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm afraid. I'm terrified. Ah! 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 Oh Jesus! No, fuck you! Fuck you, I'm out! No! No! I don't wanna die! I don't wanna die! Oh, Lon Johnson! Oh, Don Piano! I know I'm supposed to destroy both of them, but... I would rather survive than not die. Wait. I would rather die than sur... I don't know. Shit. When it splits, you have to kill the smaller part first. Also, you need to have OP intensify equipped on you or else it doesn't count. Well, I fucked this up on every count. <laughs> I have screwed up. This is entirely my fault. Um, crap. <laughs> I could probably build a better build than this heavy rocket build. Yes, the rockets are good, but I think some, some grenades will probably go a much longer way towards helping me do this, because then I can also lock on. And as you can see, I was having trouble hitting the heavy thing. So I'm going to try... I'm going to try... Uh, heavy missile, honestly. That thing weighs a shit ton, though. Get rid of that. I know this is probably not the best idea, uh, but I want to try it, you guys, so bear with me. Shit, even that is not enough. I wonder if maybe tank treads are going to be the way to go for this. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just build the heaviest, stupidest thing we can. <laughs> All right, weight is 8,673, so 8,600 it is. Let's go for it, you guys. Let's let's fucking do it. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Got good arms. Good everything. Let's do this. Because if I can just hit that moving thing with heavy missiles, I mean, that's that's good. The large rockets fuck up the quickest. I recommend using a sniper rifle in the wrong, longest range FCS in the game to take care of the smaller parts. Um, we may try that. Uh... Howitzer will probably be good for the big part later on. Right, we've got that thing. You know what? Where is it? Where is it? Wait, back unit L? Is that where I need to equip it from? Let's see. So I've got those, those dual shoulder monsters. Where are those? Oh, I just straight up can't equip them on this, maybe? I don't know. I've got that one shoulder piece that that both shoulder pieces go for one damn uh, uh, thing um a bob words I can't think of. There we go. <laughs> Booster unequipped. All right, now we have all the weight in the world. So we can equip that thing. You know what? Let's do this. Um, I should know this. I apologize for even having to ask. Um, do I have to stand still to fire that thing using tank treads? I don't think I do. I'm still asking the stupid idiot question. Uh, okay, there's the big heavy one. All right, for the shoulder bits, we want that because we don't have anything else energy. Uh, we've got nothing to equip on the inside. We've got the heaviest of everything else. We've got the long range fire control system. Don't need a booster. All right, I think this is the way, you guys. I think this will. I think this will lead us to ultimate victory. This is our final solution. Not really, but whatever. Also, our name is Smug Wendy because of the memes, Jack. Uh, by the way, we're going to fuck around with this mission until we beat it. Uh, once we beat it, that's going to be the end of the stream. Um, I do have to actually cook food for my wife and child at some point. So, uh, sorry you guys, uh, but this does have to end. <laughs> I'm genuinely hoping you have all enjoyed yourself. Oop, nope, right back here. 
Um, I'm genuinely hoping you're all enjoying yourself, and if you do, I will be streaming this again um, sometime in the near future, possibly as early as tomorrow. Um, if you are interested in checking out more of our streams, um, uh, I update via Twitter, um, and there's a link to our Twitter right below here. Um, I'll usually, I'll usually first thing in the morning, uh, send out a notification saying, hey, we're streaming at, at this point in time. Uh, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this, and hopefully you guys will be able to come hang out with us again. Uh, I would definitely appreciate it because I'm having a ton of fun. Um, where the fuck is it? Oh, it's behind this thing. I'm definitely having a ton of fun uh, doing this and streaming with all uh, you guys. There, don't you know? All right, this is what we want. Equip our extensions here. Oh, well, that was a fucking waste. Hey, I hit it anyways. Okay, it took four shots from that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah, okay. Now we're going to switch to the missile to take out that fucking thing. And we're going to do our best to stay far the fuck away from it. Uh-oh. Here's, here's where we fucking lose. Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh... Yeah, maybe the sniper right... Ooh, wow! Wow, they fucking destroyed us. Damn. Okay, so I'm gonna have to hide around that... I'm gonna have to hide around that structure in the center, I think, and just keep circling around it backwards while I fire at the uh, the paint things. Um, I know you guys are recommending rockets. Um, so I will try the rockets um, here very soon. Uh using a missile that's slower than the flying robot. That's a good strat. Damn it. Okay. Okay, fine. I get your point, damn it. <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, well, the good news is we have a ton of other stuff we can equip up there. Does it really fire that slow? I didn't know that. Might want to use the wreckage in the middle as cover. Yeah, okay. Okay, I agree with you. I agree with that strat. All right, we're going... Wait, do I only have one of those? Shit, I'm gonna have to buy another one. Okay. I think we got this, you guys. I think... There it is. I haven't bought it yet. What do you guys think of this? Should I use this fucking monstrosity? I'm gonna buy it. You guys tell me. You guys tell me what to do with my life. Tell me how I can please you. <laughs> go big or go home. I love it. Except you're already home, so I don't know. Damn it! Fuck it. Let's try it! <laughs> this thing is like the vector cannon from uh, from Zone of the Enders, the second runner. <laughs> Alright, a quick save, and then we will try it. Okay, compared to the, the grenade launcher, that thing does a lot more damage. So my hope is that two shots from that will destroy those things. And hopefully it fires fast enough that it can hit those big giant things in the air. Let's go over to the mission and try it again. All right, you guys, let's do it. I think we're gonna find our light, our way. We're not gonna. We're we're gonna don't lose our way. Row, row, fight the power. <laughs> Nothing compares to the vector cannon. I like that you capitalized it all too. Y you were right to capitalize it all. <laughs> Man, maybe I should equip a, a, a missile-based extension to take care of those missiles as well, because... Uh, oh, wow. I can I can already aim at it. Shit! Come on. Come on. Come around. Come around. Come around. Oh, perfect! Perfect! Yeah! Come on. Come on. Come on. Damn it, I didn't make it around the corner in time. <laughs> corner scumming out boss fights. Yeah, that's enough to get it. Yeah! You can bring the consort with you if you just want to get the OP intensify first. Um, I didn't know that was an option. I'm an idiot. Shit! Come on, hit it. Yes! Uh, where's this thing? Okay, cool. I'm hiding around this thing. That thing's way the fuck off distance. Where are you? There you are. Come on, turn around. 
Face me, damn you. Actually, will that hit it? Got it. All right, that thing's out now. Oh, is that gonna hit it? Damn, yeah! Where is the big piece? There's the big one over there, okay. This is not going too poorly. Can I take some pot shots at this asshole in the meantime? Damn it. Damn it. Wasting shots here. The good news is that, like, with that thing just kind of being stuck over there, the problem is, like, I'm going to have to take on the the big one now with my howitzer. Is that it? Is it going down? Oh, God. Oh, God. What is that sound? Oh, help me, Tom Cruise. Help me, Jewish God. No, it's not dead. What the fuck? Holy shit. That thing is real. And there's my last shot. Shit. Shit. Okay. So that linear cannon on the back was not not a good idea. Okay. Take me! Take me! Kill me! There we go. <laughs> that thing has got some that thing has got some armor to it. Wow. No, I wanna get them I wanna get them both at once. I seriously do. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to. You know it's dead when you see multiple explosions. Okay. All right, let's see. Is this going to game over me? Probably not because I've beaten the game already. So how could I get a game over? Okay. All right, here we go. Uh, let's very quickly... Let's go... That that weapon on the back did a really good job, actually. Um, You know what? What about some arms? All right, that does a thousand. Does... That does 300, that does 1240, 1050, 1500, 1780, 780, 780, 200. Oh, do I have the big giant arms already? Let's take a look. Assembly. No, it'll work. You just need to use a sniper rifle instead of a grenade rifle. Okay. Um, I will try that. But I want to try these fuckers first because those do a lot of damage. Um, might work. Why not? <laughs> the thing's offensive power is so ridiculously strong. Also, if I don't miss four shots from the giant thing on my back, using arms, try using arms with the highest recoil control you can find. That might be worth it too. Okay. All right, we'll try this. If this doesn't work, um, we'll go with high recoil control arms, uh, sniper rifle, all that stuff. I feel like we can do this. I feel like we can achieve ultimate victory here today, gents, and possibly ladies. That's the target. Yeah, that's the target. No, I get it. Right, let's switch to my ultimate murder gun. All right, there's a good hit. All right, you're coming around this way. There's another good hit. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Shit! Damn it. Damn it again. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I get it. Alright, we need to get the fuck away from that thing. Holy shit. Oh, wow. And I'm out of charge. I'm getting my ass handed to me by that one. Okay, we need to hide from that one and aim at this one. Okay. Damn it! Wow, okay. So is it just above me? It is just above me. Damn it! Wow! We had trouble there. Oh. Oh, man. Okay, come on. Come on, let's go. Let's go. The damage those things were doing was okay. Uh, but I'm gonna I'm gonna take your advice and we're gonna go with high recoil control arms and a sniper rifle uh, for the second part here. Uh, what do you guys think about the shoulder piece? Should I keep that one on or should I replace it for two of the grenade launcher ones? Because um, I'm open to doing that as well. <laughs> At this point, it's just like how many big fucking guns can we strap to this thing before we break through the wall? 
All right. Let's look at the arms. All right, recook 279, 280, 276, 330, 300, 330, 330, 300. All right, so it looks like we're looking at 330 here. 1920 or 1880. These are good. Use a moonlight and a large rocket. But I've not, I ha, I I wasn't doing good with the large rocket. Although I do agree with the moonlight. Okay. Let, yeah. You know what? Okay. Okay. Hey Sam, five more minutes and I'll make dinner. Got it? Okay. Cool. All right. This is by far the most annoying OP intensify bonus to get. I completely agree with you, sir. All right. There's almost no point in having anything equipped on the right arm for this. All right. So I've got that sniper rifle, but you were suggesting Karasawa, and I like that idea. Okay, there's the Karasawa. Let's go with the large rocket. There's the large rocket. Try a pile bunker instead. <laughs> Just run up and punch it? Dual back attachment unequipped. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. I still have plenty of weight to equip. One of, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, one of these. There we go. Okay, this might do it. Our offensive points went way down, but we've got more ammo to deal with this now. So as long as I get around, it's the moonlight and the large rocket. <laughs> Man, I don't think, I don't think I even have the skill to even try some shit like that. System, arena, mail, mission. There's where we want to go. At least we aren't getting stuck with a damn uh, game over screen at this point. That was super annoying when we were going through the fucking tunnel in that one mission that killed a different stream. That was super annoying. <laughs> yeah, no, I get it. It's there. Yeah, it's big and intimidating. Suck my ass. Well, I missed it with the majority of my shots. Come on, you son of a bitch. Hey, we got it. Pile bunking massive MTs is useful in Last Raven, especially when you have to fight multiples of them. Good to know. Shit, 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 shit. All right, we need to get away from that fucking thing. And I'm out of charge. So now it's me and my stupid grenade launcher. Oh my god, this thing is such a fucking problem, dudes. Great. That was stupid. Wow. Wow, I'm having no luck with this. Maybe moving would actually be useful for me at this point. Okay, this is good. This is working out, except for the fact that I'm getting hit with missiles that are bigger than everything that's ever existed in life. And I don't know, shut up. Damn it, man. This is becoming a serious problem. All right, sorry guys, but this is gonna have to be my last attempt. If I unfortunately can't get it here, that's gonna have to be it for the end of the, or for the rest of the day. Damn, okay. Yeah, sorry guys, but we're gonna have to end this one in failure. At least we took out Exile with some good cheese. Uh, we'll definitely go after this next time. Um, I think we've got at least one more good stream left in us for Armored Core 3, so hopefully you guys will join us next time. Um, if you guys liked what you saw, you should definitely leave a follow. Uh, this stream will be archived over on the YouTube channel. Uh, there's the link uh, below for that. Um, we also do Let's Plays and like funny comedy videos over there occasionally. Um, so if you like that kind of stuff, you should subscribe over there too. Uh, follow us on Twitter for updates on when our, our streams are going to be. Uh, once again, I'm Jeff. Thank you guys so much for coming out. Yes, the Blackface Boys have unfortunately failed. Uh, so yeah, once again, thank you guys so much for coming out. I, I appreciate the ever-loving shit out of it. And all of you hanging out in the chat, uh, I will see you next time.